The Pyrenean Mountain Dog is a large breed of dog used as a livestock guardian dog. It should not be confused with the Pyrenean Mastiff. The Pyrenean Mountain Dog is the best friend of kids and the ideal patrolman for the backyard and yard, past which even the nimblest mouse will not slip unnoticed. Despite the elegant appearance, this Snow White Brutal is unpretentious and moderately tempered, therefore it is able to happily live in a street kennel. The breed's patience is also almost angelic, the Pyrenees agree to share their own possessions with any four-legged creatures, provided that the animals do not try to take away their guard status and do not pretend to be an alpha. Highlights The breed has several informal names. For example, sometimes its representatives are called Pyrenean Mountain Dogs or simply Pyrenees. The Turkish Akbash, Hungarian Kuvis and Marema Abruzzo Sheepdog are considered distant relatives of the Pyrenees. According to dog handlers, all four breeds once had a common ancestor. Distinctive features of the Great Pyrenees are an intelligent, soulful look, Pyrenean expression of the eyes, and a good-natured smile. Pyrenean mountain dogs love water and swim well, so you can take them with you for the weekend near the water bodies. A person who has basic training skills for large breeds should be involved in raising and training a puppy. Pyrenean mountain dogs are strong-willed and independent creatures, therefore they are not eager to obey from the very first lessons. With a certain diligence on the part of the owner, Pyrenees are able to achieve good results in disciplines like agility and freestyle, although in the canine environment, representatives of this family are not considered the most athletic pets. The breed is not suitable for keeping in apartments due to its impressive size and territorial instinct, which cannot be realized in a limited space. Physiologically and psychologically, large Pyrenees reach full maturity only by three years. History of the Breed Pyrenean Mountain Dog The genetic roots of the Pyrenean Mountain Dogs are lost in the darkness of centuries, therefore, it is not possible to establish their relationship with existing and extinct breeds. According to one of the versions, the progenitors of the Snow White Dogs were Tibetan Mollus-like dogs, which from ancient times were crossed with local producers in the French part of the Pyrenees. They were engaged in breeding experiments, mainly, shepherds who needed massive sensitive animals that could drive away hungry predators from the sheep or even come into confrontation with them, therefore the nature of the ancestors of the Pyrenees was Nordic and their habits were fierce. The breed has been mentioned in printed sources since the 14th century. One of the first descriptions of the appearance of the Pyrenean mountain dogs belongs to the abbot of the French monastery Miguel Agustin, who at the same time explained why medieval breeders preferred individuals with white fur. According to the monk, the snow-white color helped the shepherd not to confuse the dog with a wolf. In addition, it was easier to look for dogs with light hair if, carried away by the pursuit of predators, they fought off the herd and got lost in the valleys. By the end of the 17th century, the Great Pyrenees had moved away from pastoral affairs and began to guard feudal castles, which was facilitated by the increased public relations of the Madame de Maintenon breed. It was the favorite of Louis XIV who was the first to bring to Versailles the amusing puppies of the Pyrenean mountain dog, which charmed the entire palace nobility, including the young dauphin. In the 19th century, the population of predators in the mountainous regions of France declined, and the noblemen's quarters no longer needed a four-legged guard, so the need for the services of working dogs disappeared. However, the Pyrenees were not taken by surprise, since by that time they had successfully mastered a new niche, dog shows. Before the preliminary standardization of the breed in 1923, its representatives were divided into two types, Western and Eastern. Westerners were distinguished by a markedly Malachian appearance, they had large heads with pendulous lips and rounded ears, as well as a thin wavy hair of wider black color. Dogs from the eastern regions of the Pyrenees looked more intelligent than their relatives in the group. The muzzles of the animals were of an elongated pointed type, like the ears, and the soft thick wool had a solid snow-white color. In the early 1930s, Pyrenean Mountain Dogs were bred in the United States, and in 1933 the breed was registered by the American Kennel Club. An interesting fact, in modern representatives of the Leonberger breed, along with the genes of St. Bernard's and Newfoundland's, the blood of the Pyrenean Mountain Dogs also flows. Pyrenean Mountain Dog. Breed Description. Pyrenean Mountain Dogs on the exterior are similar to the wolf-like dogs of the oldest breeds. For centuries, people have selected the largest puppies with the lightest coats so that they can be seen in dense vegetation. Also, white dogs were different from wolves, so shepherds did not confuse dogs with predators in the dark and could also shoot wolves during a fight with a dog. Pyrenean dogs have a large body and high growth, from 75 cm. The weight of such dogs can reach 55 kg, but the dog does not look bulky. These dogs are quite elegant and easy to walk. According to the standard, dogs should have a round skull, not massive, with a pronounced snape. The skull should be as long as the muzzle. 
The muzzle is wedge-shaped, the transition to the forehead is smooth, without obvious bend. These dogs have almost no superciliary arches and cheekbones, the cheeks are almost not expressed. The eyes of the Pyrenean mountain dog are small, almond-shaped and wide-set. The color of the iris can be in all shades of brown, up to almost black. The eyelids cover the eyeball well, but are not clearly expressed due to the dark color. Due to this, the dog's gaze is considered conscious and attentive. Pyrenean dogs have small triangular ears that are set fairly low. The tips of the ears are not sharp, but rounded, reaching the corners of the eyes. The hair on the top and bottom of the muzzle forms a toe that extends to the base of the ear. The bite of such dogs is scissor or straight. Strong white teeth are slightly deviated inward. The lips tightly cover the teeth, are black, like the nose. The stretched body of such dogs looks overly elongated more in length than in height. Pyrenees dogs have a straight strong back with a low tail and pronounced croup. Paws are strong, joints are visible. Popular colors of Pyrenean mountain dogs. The coat of the Pyrenean mountain dog is unique in its structure. Underneath there is a dense undercoat, dense, but very soft, pleasant to the touch. It is not long, therefore it is completely covered by the top layer of wool. The outer hair is straight, sometimes wriggling a little, but not curly. The top layer of hair is very long and hard. Thick hair on the back of the hind legs forms something like pants, and a rim that looks like a lion's mane grows around the neck. The tail is also covered with long hair, which becomes shorter towards the end. The muzzle and ears are covered with a smooth, short coat. The thick coat of the Pyrenean mountain dogs is self-cleaning, which makes this breed easy to keep. Colors of the Pyrenean mountain dog. The most popular color is considered to be snow white. It is he who is valued among breeders as the most noble. Dogs with snow white coats have the greatest chances to win at the show, color with pale yellow, light beige spots on the body is allowed. The spots must be very large and barely visible. They do not occupy more than a third of the white space on the dog. Darker spots are not allowed by all canine organizations, but they have a place to be. These are light gray, reddish and badger spots that are located on the head or tail. The nature and habits of the Pyrenean mountain dogs. Pyrenean mountain dogs are distinguished by extremely positive qualities, kindness, patience, a sharp mind and devotion to their owners. These large dogs have not lost their guarding qualities and still show a penchant for herding work. Despite this, Pyrenean dogs are excellent companions. These dogs, because of their patience, love children, allowing them to ride on their backs. Even adult dogs can support children in playing with them, but at the same time they will not allow the child to get into trouble, vigilantly observing his movements. Pyrenees dogs are even used for psychological rehabilitation of children with developmental disabilities. Dogs also get along well with other pets, including cats. A well-mannered and intelligent dog will never touch someone who does not interfere with him or his owners. They do not show unreasonable aggression, on the contrary, they demonstrate a balanced character. But due to their protective qualities, these dogs are always wary of strangers. Interesting fact, when a stranger comes to visit, these dogs show an increased interest in him, trying to sniff. So the dog makes sure that the stranger does not threaten the owners, and then it can even allow itself to be stroked. But throughout the stay of strangers in the house, the dog will watch them. Pyrenees dogs are good watchmen. They faithfully guard the territory of the house and family members. The barking of these dogs and the formidable appearance are able to scare off any invaders. Although these dogs are not stubborn, sometimes they can show extra independence, making decisions without the knowledge of the owners. For example, if a dog senses danger, he can leave the territory of the house to eliminate it.